Okie dokie, three months of tags, May, June, and July, five questions a day, every day. This is the May 17th edition. Lots and lots and lots of tags to go. What is uh, your happiest childhood memory? Uh, what makes it uh, so special? You know, I, I just ans answered this in uh, another set of questions I'm doing for May. Uh, question of the day in May, I just answered it on those. Uh, just the other day, a couple of days ago. Anyways, um, my happiest childhood moment was a Christmas uh, Christmas day when I was nine or ten, something like that. And it was just the perfect day to be um, a child, you know what I mean? It was a perfect day. I was happy throughout the entire day. Nothing made me irritated or pissy or sad or anything. It was just happiness the entire day, right? Uh, so it was perfect. It was perfect. And it just felt good to be uh, with my uh, with my family and uh, um, the, the entire thing was just beautiful. There was snow falling outside. Big snowflakes. Great big snowflakes, right? big fluffy snowflakes and it was pretty and uh, uh, it was just so nice just so very nice we had uh, we had relatives come over and uh, I got to play with my cousins and we got to my uh, my aunt and uncle gave me a record um, the Eagles uh, I forget the album uh, but it had a long run on it I don't remember the album. I don't have it anymore. And it's, it's very, 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 very long ago. It's 47, 48 years ago. So that's a long time ago. Anyways, I had literally never heard of them, uh, the Eagles, before. And I'm glad they gave it to me because it was awesome. <laughs> I'm like, this is really freaking good, you know? Uh, I, I had a little stereo. Um, it was a... Uh, what the hell was it? It was 30 watts or something like that, uh, 15 per side, uh, two-way speaker on each side. It wasn't the best stereo in the world, and it was uh, good enough for a 10-year-old, though. You know what I mean? So, yeah, and uh, we, we sat there, and we, we listened to that, and we played uh, we played games. I had, uh, I had these little casino game things, and... Uh, uh, my cousin like to cousins like to play them, and uh, so we played the casino games, and it was fun. It was really fun. Yeah, yeah, that was a perfect day. Uh, do you own uh, your uh, things, or do your things own you? I own my things. Uh, they don't own me. I'm not living for my things. Uh, that being said, uh, I'm, I'm going very out of my way to replace my bed. Uh, when you're when you're poor, you uh, you, uh, you it's hard to do things like uh, buy a new bed. So you know, uh, but yeah, I'm not living for my things. That's that's for sure. I'm not uh, uh, living for your things. Is when you're working hard so you can have stuff so that you can say to other people, look, look what I've got, you know, that uh, prestige of ownership thing, uh, that's uh, being owned by your things. Uh-huh, and uh, I, I know far too many people that are, they have to have uh, so much debt, it's, it's not funny because they're not making enough money to have a hundred thousand dollar truck, you know. Uh, would you rather lose all of your old memories or never be able to make old, new ones? Uh, I would rather be able to never make new ones, I think. Uh, because my old memories are very, very important to me. Uh, how do you uh, deal with some someone in a uh, position of power who wants you to fail? Uh, you get out of that situation. You, you don't deal with it. You get out of the situation. Uh, uh, somebody, you have a boss that doesn't want you to succeed. You get the 
go out of there and you get a different job if you can. Uh, I'll, I'll give you a hint though. Get the get the other job before you quit. Get the other job before you quit. Uh, because if you quit before you get the other job, you might not, you might be screwed. And it's it's better to be in a bad job than have no job. So if you ask me. Anyways, uh, that being said, there are some jobs that uh, part time, very part time, minimum wage jobs that you can't make a living off of. Um, I don't know if that's worth being in that situation. But anyways, um, what do you have uh, that you cannot live without uh, right here? I'm talking to it myself on my smartphone. Uh, I, I can't live without my smartphone. It's uh, it's everything, basically. Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Uh, everything's on it. Uh, my entire world's on it. All the apps that I, I need, my banking is on it. I bank on my phone. I don't go to the bank. I bank on my phone. Uh, I need to receive or send money. I do it from my phone. Uh, it's, it's that simple. I order my groceries from my phone. I order my... Uh, my pillowy thing over there, I ordered that on my phone. It's all, uh, it's all on my phone. It's, uh, yeah, uh-huh. I've got the information in my cloud that I, that I need, like my uh, prescriptions, lists, and all that stuff, you know. Everything's on there, so, yeah. Anyways, you have a fabulous day. Keep smiling, y'all. See you tomorrow.